Here we go, fight number three. You're on Epicenter TV at the junior welterweight limit of 63.5 through the 80s. The best junior welterweight, Aaron Pryor, we through the 90s. clean all the time. Jacob, don't sell all the time. Don't head up, hold it low, bro. When I say, you must stop it. You ready? Duck, duck. Concise referee's instructions there through the 90s at the junior welterweight limit. It was primarily Julio Julio Cesar Chavez through the late 90s and the mid 2000s. Australia's Costa Zoo now at the junior welterweight limit of 63.5. It's time for Wing Vanier and Jaden the Bullet Buan to shine. Here we go. Look for crazy speed from the Australian. Jaden the Bullet Buan. And he begins by uncorking a super fast jab. Really relaxed style. He tags Wing Vanier straight away. Wing Dan Ye, like all Vietnamese fighters, is never bothered. And he'll need to keep them steely, that steely icy demeanor because Jaden, oh wow, nice right hand and a left hook up top. Again, followed again. Same punches by the same fighter, Wing Dan Ye. He's a tricky fighter and he's got heavy hands. Jaden the Bullet Buan, clearly the faster, more athletic fighter. The busier fighter, however, should be Wing Dan Ye. And he's definitely got the heavy hands. Wing Van Ye is fearless and he'll need to be. Because like I said, Jaden the Bullet Buan has got fantastic distance, fantastic speed. As we see him slip and roll and duck as Wing Van Ye wings a few leaping hooks. Wing Van Ye putting the pressure on coming forward. Super fast thanks by the super fast Jaden the Bullet Buan. Lands a glancing right hand there, does Wing Van Ye. The Bullet, good jab. Exchange hard right hands. Jaden got the better at that affair. Good double left hooks to the head and the body. Clever stuff from who's essentially a kid. Jaden the Bullet Buan employing excellent head movement. Hello, Floyd Mayweather. Not getting tagged. Sitting right in the pocket. Wing Van Ye wearing a couple of shots there. Oh, Jaden the Bullet Buan. The Bullet has got to be careful. Wing Van Ye will take every opportunity he can get. Van Ye slowly inching forward. Jaden dominating round number one. The greater hand speed and the greater foot speed. Good counter right hand there by Jaden. He's pushed onto the ropes and mauled, but he's not hit. Most important thing, he catches the hard left hooks of the body by Van Ye. Good right hand. Slides out of the way and pivots around to the left. Catches that left hook. Wing Van Ye looking strong, compact, but not able to do enough damage in round number one. 30 seconds to go. Round number one, a fight number three. Beautiful right uppercut. Beautifully timed by Jaden the Bullet for one. He catches a, somewhat of a left hook in response. Wing Van Ye got his hands high. He clearly respects the hand speed. But Jaden, the bullet won. Jaden, showing all kinds of angles, never staying still. He's a mobile fighter and he's a fast fighter. He dodges, Prince Nazim style. Out of the way of that right hand of the body and then under that left hook. Wing Van Ye wears a, a lead right hook for his troubles as he comes forward. Jaden won, hits him on the bell. Fighters touch club. It's a great round. Both fighters showed what they're made of. Speed! Jaden, the bullet, Buan. And power, and a more compact stance. Wing Van Ye. Getting ready for round number two. Fight number three. Really well contested round number one. The faster shot. Landing flush. Jaden the bullet one from the Bondo Boxing Club. Head trainer Tony Delvecchio has got a like what he sees and so is Jaden's dad. In the corner. It's a family affair here, as are all the fights. 
involving the Bondo Boxing Club. Beautiful gym. Gym where I cut my teeth. Learn the trade. Good counter shots by Jaden. Good body shot by Wing Van Ye. We'll see a little more intensity, a little more inspiration from Wing Van, Wing Van Ye. And again, it's Jaden the Bullet One who gets off double left hooks to the head and the body again. She's got the faster hands. Jaden the Bullet One. The Bullet lands another right hand there. Wing Van Ye is coming forward. Van Ye looking to turn the tide. And again, it's the Bullet. And in hard right hand, he's just. Getting out of range just in time. Wing Vanier keeps hitting air. Still early in the fight. This is round number two of fight number three. Nice right uppercut by Jaden and a beautiful left hook to the body by Vanier. And a good right hand and another right hand. Exchanging right hands there. Both fighters walking through them. Jaden moving around the perimeter. Beautiful counter right hand there by Jaden. Timed in between the shots of Wing Vanier. We can see who the hand and the foot speed belongs to. Jaden really looking good. In round number two, the referee breaks him. Jaden momentarily going southpaw. Good body shots again by Jaden. I'm expecting more. And there I go, a little bit more. A left hook by Wing Van Yeh. I really thought Wing Van Yeh would get some momentum early. But at this point, he lands ironically a right hand there, a really good right hand. He just hasn't got enough momentum. He's a very busy fighter, but it's the angles, the unpredictable style, and more than anything else, the speed of the bullet. It's carrying the tide of this fight. Another beautiful counter right hand. Wing Van Yeh, unbothered. Van Yeh can wear them all day, but he's not winning the fight. He's losing. Keep walking forward. He's got, to, he's got to do a little more, as you see there again. Jaden the bullet won. Too fast. Good body shots by Van Yeh. Jaden closing up shop on the inside, maybe taking a momentary breather, but he's got to be careful. Careful, rather. Van Yeh has got crippling body shots. Nice, nice head movement by the Australian. A nice right hand. Wing Van Yeh walks straight through it. Good body shot by Van Yeh. That's where he wants to put his fighter on the ropes. Referee calls break. 45 seconds. Round number two. Round number two. Good body shots. Good left hook to the head by Van Yeh. Good right hand. Trading shots. Now there's some hard body work. Hard body work. There by Wing Van Yeh. Good right uppercut and a hard slapping left hook. Partially blocked by the bullet. Interestingly, the bullet and the bullet and only not. I was about to say 90. 18 years old. He's wearing these shots easily. So he pulls back, counter left hook doesn't quite land. He looks unbothered at this point by the power. 10 seconds to go. Round number two. Double left hook to the body by Vanier. Wow. We see a cut on the left temple of the Viet Vanier. Hopefully they've got an end swell. They'll do some work. That is two rounds to the Australian from the Bondo Boxing Club. Yaden the Bullet won. on the slow-mo hard shot slanted by both fighters a good right hand and then a good left hook both shots slanted by Wim Van Yeh they sent some hard shots good left hook to the body a good right hand and the head by there's some really good body work momentary definitive set success by Van Yeh grinds the bullet into the ropes better round in round number two Wim Van Yeh especially the second half that was still on this Commentator scorecard, a bullet one round. I would have success. I would have would success. Oh wow! <laughs> Jaden, 18 years old, showing some strength on the deadlift. He's a fast fighter. He's also a strong fighter. And what I would su suspect in this round is we see Jaden with a quadruple, of five or six or seven jabs. Jaden slowed down a little bit. Van Yeh get a little more momentum as we see so hear some Aussies in the background. But it's Jaden landing the better shots at range. He's just got Van Yeh worked out at this point. Van Yeh coming forward. If I was in Van Yeh's corner, I'd be imploring him. Intensity like this. Jaden unmarked and undeterred. Van Yeh coming forward. He cut the left temple. He shows his strength there. 
Referee warns him. Good job, Jaden the bullet for one. Good head movement, Jaden just showing Van Yate a variety, a variety of looks. He's either moving his feet around the ring or he's moving his head. Very hard to hit, fighter with the hand speed and the tactical moves of Jaden. Beautiful left hooks on the inside of the on the inside of the elbow there into the sternum. Typically you see the left hook go around the elbow to the liver, but Jaden landed it inside the elbow. He looks really relaxed, he's really found his range. He lands a good right hand there and ducks under the counter left hook. And then, yeah, very comfortable stuff. Jaden looking strong. He's got to be careful though, he lands a good right hand there and a good right uppercut on the inside. Then, yay, just can't keep up with the hand speed and the dimensions of the bullet as we cut to the Vietnamese corner. Two fights, both invi involving Vietnamese fighters thus far. Both fights won by Viets. This fight, however, has been one-way Australian traffic. Not entirely one-sided, as we see Van Ye land some good shots, but primarily in Jaden the Bullet, Buam. Carrying this fight. Carrying this fight. They tangle up on the ropes. The referee breaks him. Right hand, left hook to the body by Jaden, both blocked by Van Ye. I did expect a little less respect given by the Viet. I thought he'd come forward with a little more steam. But he's obviously perplexed by the game plan from Tony Del Vecchio, as well as the athleticism and the precision of Jaden the Bullet. One. Better round, round number three for Vanier. Still a tough round to score as they exchange hard shots. This is Vanier's game. Not quite the punch count that I expected. And again there, they break, they move off, and it's Jaden shooting and scoring first. 10 seconds to go. They both have good shots there. You get the classic sweat flying off the face look under the lights at Juan Kiem Lake. Hard right hand to punctuate round number three. That is a tough round to score. Great stuff from both fighters in round number three. Out the ring card girl, she's very happy to be under the lights. Been a lot of action and activity in the ring. I'm not sure if we've had any long shots at the arena, the event. There's expected to be 20,000 people here, and I've stood up on top of my chair, and it looks like there's 20,000 people here. This place is packed. Oh, that is a huge shot by the bullet. And what was a much closer round, we see Van Ye there land some good shots. Good right up cut by Bullet and a good counter left hook right hand by Van Ye and another shot by Jay. They're trading punches here. Ironically, both these guys are boxers. They both come forward. I mean, they, go, they both go backwards to me. Ironically, they're both holding their ground a whole lot more. Very impressed. Jaden, for my liking, historically, I've seen him for about a year. Has been more of an on your bike kind of fighter. But in this fight, he's planting his feet, he's uncorking the better combinations. And for the majority of this fight, he's carrying the rounds. So we see him on his bike here. Beautiful slide off, pivoting back to the left. The superior footwork and a beautiful jab by the bullet. Vernier game. Cut above the left eye. Unbothered. Beautiful left hook and then a right hook by the bullet. I am Australian, but I, I don't want to sound biased. But this is primarily one-way traffic. The bullet having a field day in there, showing him so many different looks. And he sets his feet in the middle of the ring and he momentarily moves Vanier backwards. And it's a good right hand. Vanier tries to maul on the inside, get a few shots. 40 seconds down in the final round. Round number four. Vanier, lead right hand, hard left hook. He just can't quite land it. It's either the feet or the upper body movement of Jade in the bullet one. Good shots there on the inside, primarily by the bullet. Less than two minutes to go, round number four. At this point, it looks like, I'd almost say Jaden's the fresher fighter. I think at a spiritual or at least a psychological level, Vernier's annoyed and not in, a, um, in an incensed, aggressive fashion, more in a dismayed fashion. He can't tag, he can't mount, he can tag the Australian, but he can't mount, mount any sustained offense. And again, it's Jaden that gets off first and turns off. Masterful boxing by the bullet from the Bondo Boxing Club. 
Good counter right hand by Van Ye. I'd like to see a little more of that. There's a short chopping right hook to the body on the break. Borderline illegal. Jaden's not bothered. Jaden keeps giving them looks. Ducks, pivots, turns southpaw, puts both hands up, drops, drops his left hand, spins off. Hard right hands by both fighters. Neither shot lands. Good left hook by the bullet. Bullet's having a field day at this point. Van Ye has got to come forward with more aggression. Good right uppercut on the inside by Van Ye. Narrowly misses with the right hand. That's two times. Jaden Bullet Bouan with a Floyd Mayweather style. Philly Shell is able to avoid and beautifully evade hard shots by Van Ye. Van Ye gets some good inside work there, but it's not enough. It's not bothering Jaden. The flashier and the flusher shots are landed again by the Australian. The Bullet. Beautiful performance. Van Ye coming forward, but there's not enough offense from him. He's coming forward. That's what he should have been doing from the start, wrestling, punching on the break, moving the smaller, younger fighter around, but he just can't do it. Jaden's too fast. Good jab there by Vanier and a good left hook by Vanier. They call it a little too late. Nice right hand over the top by Jaden. Four rounds done. Vanier lands on the bell. It is not enough on this commentator's scorecard. I'm giving that a unanimous decision. Wonderful effort, wonderful effort by the Viet. Wing Van Ye, it's not enough. Jaden the Bullet, one. Thưa quý vị, thật sự là buổi tối ngày hôm nay, ngoài Excellent. những trận đấu hết sức hấp dẫn, hết sức nảy lửa, cũng như là sự cổ động rất nhiệt tình từ các cổ động viên, thì mấy anh cũng thấy là âm thanh buổi tối ngày hôm nay, âm nhạc cũng rất hay và phù hợp với chương trình Victoria Huyền Thoại Hoàng Kiếm sẽ khiến chúng ta có những giây phút rất khó quên vào đêm thứ bảy này đúng không anh Mạnh Tùng? Đó chính là điểm đặc biệt ở những môn thi đấu và được tổ chức một cách chuyên nghiệp. Ở đó chúng ta có đa dạng cảm xúc khác nhau. Bên cạnh sự căng thẳng đầy kịch tính còn mang động yếu tố giải trí. Và ngày hôm nay chúng tôi sẽ mang tới quý vị trọn vẹn bữa tiệc của Victory Eight. Và vừa rồi chúng ta đã theo dõi một trận đấu hết sức là căng thẳng. Bây giờ đây hãy cùng nhau chờ đợi kết quả đến từ tổ trọng tài. It was a very amazing match, right? So now let's wait for the result from our referee. The Bullet, very happy with his performance. Get him up on the ring. Up on the ropes. I'm so nervous. Very happy. He fought at the first victory eight. Và thưa quý vị, lúc này trên tay chúng tôi đã có được kết quả từ tổ thẩm định. Kết quả từ tổ thẩm định. Trận đấu giữa Nguyễn Văn Dễ và Jaden Vaughn. Những con số rất sát sao Rất sát sao qua từng hiệp đấu Và kết quả cuối cùng Kết quả cuối cùng Ai ạ? Kết quả cổ động viên ơi Chúng ta có biết được là ai là người chiến thắng ở trận đấu vừa rồi không ạ? Kết quả cuối cùng của chúng ta Giành chiến thắng bằng tính điểm trong trận đấu này Đó là Võ sĩ trẻ tuổi Jaden Wong Và sau đây chúng tôi xin chào kính mời ông Trần Minh Tiến Một người rất tâm huyết với Bông sinh Việt Nam sẽ lên trao món quà đặc biệt Dành tới Jaden Wong